That didn't work, did it? What a way to start. Knock the camera over. So, uh, good morning. Got my coffee all the way full up here. That uh, creamer with a little bit of coffee in it. Make room right here for my coffee. All right, guys, so, uh, first off, this mustache's gotta go. I ain't really having it. It's funny. That look weird. So, you guys took good, um, I don't know the right words. You got a good response to Kenny, the uh, contractor I hired to come out. That's pretty funny. Uh, I figured I would get a lot more hate messages or comments about it saying I need to get back to work and not mess around. And uh, one guy commented, it was pretty funny. Well, he was talking trash, but it was funny. He said, all day and all you did was that one sheet of house wrap and that's it. I did more than that. I only showed that because I thought it was funny, you know, humor, that uh, I hired a professional and they did less work than... Dale the redneck so I kind of did it that way yes I did more work that day but I thought it was funny of course people still talk trash just the way it is but um, when did this world forget humor that's the that's the weird thing to me is everybody is extremely offended by everything these days um, Everything gets blown out of proportion. Everything is... It's just not the same as it was for me growing up. I was born in 1985, so I, I feel like I'm the last of dying breed of people that don't get offended. But then again, a lot of old people now get offended, and it's weird to me. It's just like the older generation, you grew up in a time that you had to be tough. And now you're offended by everything. It just blows me away. And I'm not talking about all you guys. I'm just talking about in general of the world. So it's like, when did we become so soft? And it just blows my mind. I guess I saw the curve starting to uh, drop whenever we played t-ball. We were like the first year as, you know, t-ball to start playing with the, the, not a hard baseball. It was more of the spongy soft kind or whatever and all I knew was the original baseball because that's what we grew up throwing and stuff even before we played t-ball just young 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 and uh yeah it was like from then on things just got softer and softer so I'm really glad I grew up in a different time I guess to where like I caught the tail end of it and growing up in our household you had to be tough and it's kind of like that song you know if you're gonna be dumb you gotta be tough well most of this world is dumb there's not tough anymore so I don't know it just blows my mind that we become soft as a world mainly as a country but as a world and I think a lot of it has to do with over time with social media and you used to have to have guts to talk trash to somebody because it'd be to their face and they can throat punch you. And you used to have to have guts to like go talk to your, you know, representatives of your your state or your county or whatever it may be. And now you could do everything online behind a keyboard. So let's just say if, you know, this YouTube channel, someone that doesn't like me, if they didn't like me, they would have to come talk to me face to face and see what I was doing here. And they probably wouldn't talk trash face to face with a dude with the mustache like this. That's all I'm saying. And uh, that's why I grew it out. I'm tired of people messing with me. And I figured, hey, no one's going to mess with you if you got a mustache. Have you ever seen anyone walk up and punch somebody that has a mustache? I don't think so. It's normally the guy with the mustache taking another person down. Sounds good, didn't it? But yeah. Um, quit being so soft. It, it maybe if you get online today and you're starting to get your feelings hurt over something, 
I don't know if you know this or not. All you have to do is hit the back button and it takes you right out of there. You don't have to keep watching. You don't have to keep looking at something. You don't have to comment. You don't have to let people know you're offended. All you have to do is hit back. And then your life is like literally reset back to where it was right before you clicked on that. It's crazy. Technology, you know? And, uh... I don't know, another thing too, I've never, ever, ever watched a YouTube video, ever, in my entire life, and thought, that was stupid, I'm going to let this person know, and I'm going to comment, and let them know that they are stupid. I have never commented to anyone other than a positive comment on YouTube, and this was before I even got on YouTube, I used to just not leave comments, oh, I'll watch videos, and I was like... How is this guy getting all these views? This guy is a complete moron. And then I clicked back and went to watch another video. Never told him, never, you know, nothing of that nature. So I don't get where people have the mindset of, you will know that I don't like you. You will know that I think you're stupid. And you will know that I'm stupid because I'm going to tell you you're stupid in a stupid way. It's crazy. So guys, toughen up. Um, so speaking of toughen up, the um, challenge thing I did, roast, roasting the crockers, I'll be picking a winner pretty soon. Um, I spent all day yesterday in a tent, so didn't touch my laptop, didn't edit, didn't do anything. I took it back to the basics for my sanity. And so I haven't done that, so I need to edit yesterday's video today and get it out. And then I'm going to try to uh, get, um, what's we call it, uh, all of them in a playlist. So I can go ahead and just start getting them all in there. Then I'm going to have you guys vote, and then I'm going to vote. And so we'll pick a, um, we'll pick, I'm going to pick two winners. And so, which y'all didn't know that, I wasn't going to tell y'all that. But I'm going to pick two winners. and Well, I'm going to pick a winner, and you guys are going to pick a winner. And so that way it's totally fair. This is just the internet, and then this is who I thought was the funniest. Because we all have different, you know, humor. So I don't want to just, you know, pick one. And so, um, and then I'm also going to do a lot more. I didn't really say this because I didn't want people to do it strictly for a prize. I wanted them to do it just because they wanted to and because they actually like my channel. So I'm going to do more than just a soap giveaway and a handwritten letter. There's no way that that's going to be the thing to win. So I already have some cool ideas that I want to do to give away. It's just I didn't want to be like, hey, I'm giving away money in a gift card and get a bunch of people that don't care about my channel doing it just for the money. So I just kept the prize very short and sweet and, um, uh, you know, just kept it that way so you knew that okay I'm doing this more for fun you know I want it'd be cool to win the shout out or whatever but I'm doing this because I like your channel I don't want someone to come on and do it because they didn't like me they just wanted money so or prize or whatever um, I'm not telling y'all exactly what I'm doing here so yeah I uh, hope you guys are having an awesome day it literally rained all day yesterday um, Jared is going to be featured in something kind of cool. Um, this was a last minute thing that um, I kind of negotiated for him, I guess. Not really. They emailed me. I negotiated some other stuff, but uh, it's pretty cool. It's going to get millions of views and uh, be played during the NFL draft. So that's pretty awesome. This should all be going down the next few days, and uh, unless for some reason it just doesn't. But um, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's very short, but it's cool to say that he's going to be in it and the thing that he does is freaking hilarious so whenever i post um we'll put a link and uh we'll have you get uh see if you can find him in it so all right guys i'm gonna go and call it a day finish my coffee i'm gonna find a uh cliff bar somewhere in this truck it's a mess and then uh, i gotta edit the video do all the stuff catch up so guys we'll see y'all later if i leave you with anything today it's Try today to not get offended. If something happens, hit that back button. If it's in real life, hit the back button in real life. Kind of step back. Go on with your day. Don't get offended. 
move on, get some tougher skin. You got this, guys. I believe in you. And I just saw right now that you probably never even saw my steering wheel cover because it's camouflage. And I'm wearing camouflage. You probably couldn't even see me either. Other, You just had this floating face with the mustache talking to you for 10 minutes. All right, I'm out of here. I'm going crazy.